I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will learn how to write equation of a quadratic function from graph. This time we will write equation of the given parabola in factored form. Now since we are given the x-intercepts it is easy to write equation in factored form. Let's identify the x-intercepts. The two x-intercepts are at Let's write down these points. The points are origin, which is 0, 0, right? And the other one is at 4. That means 4, 0. So these are the two x-intercepts. Now, the family of parabolas or the quadratic functions, which will have these two x-intercepts, could be written as y equals to a times x minus 0. So x minus 0. Let me write x minus 0 and x minus 4, that is a times x times x minus 4. So that becomes the family of all the parabolas which will have these two as their x-intercepts. Now to write equation of the given graph, we need to identify one more point. So let us use this particular point, which also happens to be the vertex. So the coordinates for this point is are 2 minus 2. So the coordinates x value is 2, y value is minus 2. So we'll substitute these two values here and find the value of a. So what we get is y value is minus 2. So minus 2 equals to x value is 2. So we get a times 2 times 2 minus 4, right? Which is 2 minus 4 is minus 2, minus 2 times 2 is minus 4. So we get minus 4a. So from here we get a as equals to minus 2 divided by minus 4 and that is half. So a is half. Since a is half, we can write down the equation as y equals to half of x times x minus 4. So that becomes the equation in factored form for the given parabola. So that is how we can write down the equation. So the steps involved are find the x-intercepts, write general equation for the family of parabolas going through those two x-intercepts. In this case since we had two, so two x-intercepts and then find the value of a by any point on the graph, right? We could have used any good point on this graph to find the value of A. Well, that is how we can do it. Thank you and all the best.